From the beginning of the year to the, to the end of the year, their toughness has just been night and day, really. Real easy to tell my eight-year-old son, hey, you need to play ball like them, but be good boys like them, too. They pray together and study God's Word, and so I think the Lord's blessed them just for their desire to grow as people as well as players. Based. These guys have had a weekly Bible study going on for the better part of four or five months. We did it two months before the season even started, and that was totally student-driven. I, I had nothing in it. So I think their faith in Christ is, is first and foremost. Um, and because of that, I think they have a genuine joy and love for one another. They meant a lot because, I mean, this is all my last sport. I mean, everything, I gave everything I had. It's paid off, and so is everybody else. We've always dreamed about it, like I said earlier, but it, it's just unbelievable. I, mean, I don't know what to say. Oh, this is a dream come true, you know. We've been this group of guys have been working with trying to get this for three years now, and it, it finally happened. It's just amazing. Oh, it's it's it's, it's going to be up there right now. It's my probably my best memory. Uh, great group of guys that do it with us. I couldn't be more proud of a group of seniors. Uh, the amount of work and energy that they put in. Uh, the attitude, the mental attitude that they've had, you know, they exemplify what Eagle Pride is all about.